Welcome to Classic Rock Fans to another episode of From the Wishlist where I get to say a big thank you to those of you who have kindly sent me things from my Amazon wishlist. The link of course is just below this video. First of all I'd like to say a big thank you to Jamie, one of my patrons, for sending me this wonderful new Iron Maiden album, some jutes, so you can catch my review of this album on my channel. But also this one, Bob Dylan's Blonde on Blonde. I did a video on the Bob Dylan bootleg series and I explained that I didn't actually have any Dylan albums on CD due to numerous uh, numerous albums being stolen over the years. And uh, so as a response, uh, I've had quite a few people sending me Bob Dylan CDs, which is fabulous. And of course this one is one of those uh, great, one of the greatest albums ever, I think, that came out in 1966, which was a fabulous year for music, fabulous year. So uh, thank you, Jamie, so much for sending me these. So the next one on my wish list is the Bob album, uh, Bob Dylan's Oh Mercy, which is a great record. Now when albums come out, it's always uh, wrapped up in this, this uh, hysteria and hype, greatest thing they've ever done, best thing in years. Uh, we usually have to wait for the dust to settle before we actually listen to it properly with um, unbiased, unaffected ears. Uh, but this is one of those albums where I think it almost lives up to the hyperbole. I, I think this is a great, great record. Man in the Long Black Coat is on this one. Um, covered beautifully by Joan Osborne, if you remember. Excuse me, by the way, I got stinking cold, so my voice isn't working particularly well. So uh, I'm not sure who sent this. As I said, there's no, there's no label in the Amazon package, but whoever you are, thank you so much for, for this, uh, adding to my, my, um, my collection of his bobness. What else have we got then? And we have this one as well, which is uh, for me will form part of my central summer listening. This uh, um, Love Forever Changes, classic, classic album, without a doubt. Uh, again, it's one of those albums I used to have, but uh, somehow, for some reason, uh, just misplaced. You know, it's, it's one of the pitfalls of moving around from digs to digs all the time. But I'm really glad you, this has been sent to me. I, I really enjoy this and I appreciate uh, you thinking of me to send it. I wonder if there's a label in here that identifies uh, who has actually sent it. Sometimes they do that. Uh, we hope you enjoy your gift. Uh, no, afraid not, unfortunately. But whoever you are, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. It's much, much appreciated. And then there is this gem, a Kraut Rock Masterpiece Cans. Tago Mago or Targo Margo, not sure how the vowel is pronounced here. Uh, wonderful, wonderful album, which uh, you know I haven't listened to for years, to be honest with you. But it's uh, I am so grateful you've sent this to me. Uh, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this has been sent by uh, Stephen James. Uh, so thank you so much, Stephen James, for sending this uh, to me. I will really, really enjoy hearing this once more, and also it will help me in my uh, writing of my 10 best crowd rock albums. And I'll put that aside. And here's another wonderful album, which was on my wish list, uh, but doesn't have a label or anything demonstrating who has sent it to me. Uh, nope, so Neil Young's On The Beach. What a, a great, great record this is. Um, Ambulance Blues, uh, On The Beach, Walk On. It's just absolutely brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Love the cover as well. This is this is undoubtedly a seminal Neil Young album, which uh, again a physical copy of I, I lost many years ago. I think the last copy I had was actually on vinyl, to be honest with you. Um, so whoever sent this, thank you so so much. I'd also like to thank Patrick O'Neill, who's one of my patrons, for sending me this uh, absolute gem. These series are, are brilliant. I quite like these because. Um, you know, sometimes you get these deluxe box sets and it's just too much stuff that you would never ever listen to again. But these are just uh, the albums in sleeves in a little box set. And of course, this has got all those seminal early Steve Hackett albums. Uh, you know, Voyage of the Acolyte, Please Don't Touch, Spectral Mornings, Defector and Highly Strung. Great albums, which uh, um, I now actually have a physical copy of. Um, thank you so much, Patrick, for this one. And also for this one, Street Legal by Bob Dylan. Uh, Changing of the Guards, what a wonderful song that is, New Pony. Uh, it's got Signores and Tales of Yankee Power on this one. Wonderful, wonderful record. This was about the time he played uh, the Blackbush Market gig. Um, yeah, great record. I mean, I love this album, to be honest with you. It's, it's, uh, I think a lot of the albums after this one, things start getting a bit patchy personally, but uh, uh, this is one of the, this is one of the great ones, uh, in my, my opinion, my humble opinion. Uh, so thank you, thank you so much for this. Help me replenish my lost Bob collection. 
so that's it really that's uh, from the wish list for what is it, September September we're now well into October so I'm a little bit late with this video but uh, anyway thank you so much for sending me this wonderful stuff and supporting my channel it's uh, uh, it's I'll say it again it's much appreciated anyway I hope you're all well and staying warm and fending off that dreaded lurgy but more importantly that you keep listening <laughs>